we explain social distancing during the coronavirus outbreak. Meet Joe, a family man. He wants to help slow the spread of coronavirus to keep his family safe. To start, Joe can begin practicing social distancing. Joe is curious to learn more about social distancing, so he asks his friend Tina, a public health official, to clarify. Tina explains that social distancing is a measure taken by government officials to stop or slow the spread of a highly contagious disease by reducing person-to-person -person interactions. The goal is to flatten the curve of disease progression. If the disease spreads rapidly, it's likely that healthcare systems will not be prepared to care for all of the infected patients at once. By flattening the curve, it gives local healthcare officials, like Tina, more time to prepare and care for the patients in need. There are many levels to social distancing, adds Tina. It typically starts by canceling sporting events, concerts, conferences, or any other large gatherings, and could potentially lead to all businesses, malls, and restaurants closing or altering their hours. In severe cases, strict curfews are mandated. Complete isolation may even be enforced by local authorities. Although that seems a bit harsh to Joe, Tina explains that stricter mandates on social distancing leads to a quicker eradication of the virus. Joe's proud to play his part in slowing the spread of coronavirus. Although he's young and healthy, Joe understands that he can still put others in danger. He buys just enough supplies to last him a few weeks, stays at home, and spends quality time with his family.